Hello guys, welcome back to my another, After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, Saba Social Lower Third in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. This template is available on my store, the link is provided in the description. To create this slower third you need to have installed Saba plugin, it is available for free, download link for Saba plugin is provided in the description. Here first I will import my YouTube logo. Perfect, now let's start creating lower third. Create a new composition. Here I will name it as YouTube Lower Third. Width and height is set to 1920 by 1080 pixels. Frame rate is set to 30 frames per second. Here I will set the time duration to 5 seconds. First we will add main text. Here it is my YouTube channel name. Here I am using monster at font family. Here I will change font style to bold. Now let's add the subtext. Which is subscribe now. Position it below main text. Here I will change font style to regular. Slightly reduce the font size. Perfect. Now let's add the logo to the timeline. Here I will add the fill effect for this logo. In effects and preset, search for fill. Add it to logo layer. Let's pre-compose the logo layer. Name it as YouTube logo. Here we need to adjust the scale value for logo. Place the logo composition near to the main and subtext. Perfect. Here I will set the fill color to white. Now select the pen tool. Make sure fill is set to none. Set stroke to solid color. Now you need to create the line as shown. Perfect. Here you can adjust the stroke width. Here I will set it to 10 pixels. Now we will create a new solid layer. This will be our Saba layer. From effect, in video copilot, select Saba. First, we will make this layer as transparent, for Saba, in render setting, set composition setting to transparent. Now select the rounded rectangle tool. Make sure Saba layer is selected, now we need to create mask for the Saba layer. Create mask as shown. Perfect. In Customize Core, select Core Type to Layer Mask. Perfect. Here you can see the Saba effect is applied to Mask Layer. Here you can select any preset of your choice. Here I will select Energize. Now let's animate the Saba effect. Now at 5 frames, 
Create keyframe for end offset. Set end offset to 0%. Now at 1 second, change end offset to 100%. For Sable layer, press U to view created keyframes. Select end keyframe, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. For first keyframe, change keyframe assistant to easy ease out. You can see the preview. Perfect. Here you can adjust the glow intensity. Here I will set it to 30%. Now let's animate our shape layer. For shape layer, from add, select trim paths. Now in trim paths, at 1 second and 10 frames. Create keyframe for end. At 1 second change end value to 0%. Perfect. Change end keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now we will create shapes for logo composition, and for our both text layers. Make sure you have not selected any layers, now select rectangle tool. Here you need to create shape layer hiding the logo, exactly as I have shown. Change fill to solid color. Change stroke to none. Now place the shape layer above logo composition. For logo composition, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer too. Now we will do the same for main text layer and subtext layer. Now create shape hiding the main text. Now place the shape layer above main text layer. For main text layer, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 3. Now create shape layer hiding the subtext. Now place the shape layer above subtext layer. For subtext layer, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 4. Now for logo composition, press P to bring up the position. Add 1 second and 25 frames, create keyframe for position. Now at 1 second and 5 frames. Change position value for X axis as shown. Perfect. This will hide the logo. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. For main text layer, we will do the same. Press P to bring up position. Add 1 second and 10 frames. Create keyframe for position. Add 2 seconds. Create keyframe for position. For first keyframe, we need to change the position value for X axis. You need to reduce X position value as shown. Perfect. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Now we will do the same for subtext layer. Press P to bring up position. Add 1 second and 20 frames. Create keyframe for position. Add 2 seconds and 10 frames. Create keyframe for position. For first keyframe, you need to reduce X position value as shown. Perfect. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Now let's see the preview of our lower third. Perfect. Here our lower third is created. Here you are free to adjust the position of keyframes. You can also set the color for your lower third by changing Saba color to get colorful lower third. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel.
Thank you.